Hello, people of the tubes. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to Game Squib, and uh, Florian's got uh, Florian's got something for us today, haven't you, Florian? It's a scuttle crap from League of Legends added in the recent patch. Oh, that's right. Florian's got crabs. Oh no. <laughs> Uh, what is this? Uh, is this a champion or whatever you call them? No, it's a, a jungle monster. All oh, right. It just goes around in the river, and if you kill it, it gives you gold. Oh, cool! So it's and is that to all the uh, what they call realms? I guess what are they called. It's neutral. Oh, right. right. Teams. Oh. <laughs> no, I mean like you. You know, is it added to? Different arenas, because there's only it's only been added to Summoner's Rift. Ah, uh, Summoner's Rift, right, right, which has been changed already with the yes. new crappy art style. No, you, we must play more League of Legends, Tom. Yeah, it's been a while. I'll admit, I'm uh, starting to not hate it as much from memory. <laughs> I'll give it that. Uh, Florian, you've you you are you doing this with a side by side? Uh, what? Are you, are, are you doing this like from memory or are you drawing this like I I looked at it a little bit I I always use some kind of references Yeah that's fine but uh, it uh, it looks really good I have sped it up more than usual 20 times so we can have a shorter video more <laughs> engaging and, and fast fast paced <laughs> pure Sorry. pure action Die hard <laughs> I haven't seen that film <laughs> Mm, I've seen it, but it's been a while. Oh, I saw uh, there's a teaser out for a new Terminator film, and guess who it features? Who does it feature? It features Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh my god! Yeah. It, where is he from? Is he from Austria? Yes. <laughs> but, but he's not from Tyrol. What does that mean? It's my, the province where I'm from. Oh, right. <laughs> He doesn't. Mm, he doesn't sound like he has an Austrian accent. I guess when I think about his accent and your accent, it sounds quite different. But mm. I guess he's really much more American than him. Uh, he's well, more American than me. In fact, yeah, he was the governor of California. Yeah, supposedly. <laughs> so what you think that was a dream? So it's hard to tell. Things are a blur. No, he was. He was definitely the governor of California. I, I woke up naked today. I saw. I was pretty sure I, I went to bed with the pyjama, <laughs> so it's it's a miracle, really. <laughs> it's not a miracle that you've been raped in your sleep, Florian. Oh, no, Tom. Uh, I, that's what you were dreaming. You thought, wow, that dream of being bum-raped by men was <laughs> not real. <laughs> but, but there were no signs of a forced entry. What, in the building or your body? Both. Alright, oh, okay. <laughs> Silly Tom. Uh, check with the neighbours, they might have heard something. I, uh, yeah, uh, I've had experiences like that where I think when I first moved into this house, mm. I'd sometimes wake up and kind of, on the first couple of nights, I'd feel like I've woken up in somebody else's house. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't, I couldn't, like, put it in my head that. <laughs> we were living here because yeah. the uh, the first night we the first day we moved in, we had a, a big buffet with uh, our family and uh, the you know th this is my father-in-law's old house and we oh, yeah. came up here like a few years ago you know to hang out so it's weird that we are now living in the house we used to hang out at so it's it almost felt like we were guests. <laughs> we were just uh, in his house, but you know, because we were we weren't really being a guest host. We were just part of a party, and it was like everyone went home and we were there, and it was just like okay, <laughs> it's our house now. Apparently, <laughs> why do I feel like we're guests still? Hmm. Yeah, you paid for it too. Yeah, well, yeah, we pay for it every month. But, yeah. <laughs> but don't feel like that anymore. No. Oh. You wear pajamas? Yes. Do you not? I well. Do you think that would be an, a simple yes or no answer? Well, it's <laughs> like I don't have a pajama T-shirt. I just wear any T-shirt. Oh, no, I, I like long sleeves. <laughs> I, 
and I uh, I bought pajamas, and they're about five times too big for me. But I never bothered to return them. I have the same problem. Yeah. Oh, and I still I wear them. They said on yeah, I know that's what I do. I, I, they said on the shelf extra small. <laughs> when I put them on, they're extra large. <laughs> so, <laughs> in fact, it's actually a health hazard because. The other day I fell down the stairs because of my pajamas. <laughs> Cause I can <laughs> I can walk on the bottom of the the pants. Oh no. Yeah. You're like that awesome. like that dwarf from the from the seven seven dwarfs that has the the ha the, the hanging sleeves. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's dopey. Yeah, sure that's dopey, yeah. Well yep. that's that's quite Pre drug related if you think about it. Hmm. Yeah, it's quite dopey. Well, <laughs> Some strong themes in that film. Mm. Um, you know, poison apples. Oh yeah. <laughs> dwarves all sleeping together. I think that happened in the film. I can't quite remember. <laughs> well, they wouldn't I mean, have seven beds. <laughs> <laughs> the film was made in the thirties, weren't it? <laughs> Things were different then. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my. Um. <laughs> I remembered what I I was thinking about. Um, do you know how we were mentioning? Uh, have you seen the film Woman in Black? No. You not seen that film? No. Sounds like I would never want to see it. <laughs> it's got uh, Daniel Radcliffe in it. It's a uh, like a thriller horror thing. Hmm. Uh, don't even know who that is. In fact, oh well. Uh, Harry Potter. Oh God. Yeah. Well, you know, he's a grown man in that. He's not a little kid. Well. Not a little kid in the older Harry Potter films, but you know what I mean. Hmm. And uh, I found the porn version because apparently they're coming out, <laughs> with people, and it was just called the Slut in Black, <laughs> and it was just uh, a black woman in a black dress. Oh. Fucked. <laughs> Always <laughs> with the with the porn movie adaptations. Yeah, I know it's something I really need to look up some more. It's uh, I really like how you use gradients, by the way, for your shading and stuff. Hmm. Thanks. It's a new technique. Is it? Well, new for me at least. Right, right. Okay. I've, I haven't done it before. I'm always trying to learn stuff in Photoshop. Not bad at it. Yeah, <laughs> did, did you like my old oil painting? Uh, I don't know what that is. It was the on the squid and you were like, what have I done to the squid? <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's like an oil painting filter. It's really cool and easy to do, and but probably didn't make the best effects on the <laughs> squid. <laughs> it could be better. It could be better. <laughs> oh, I love this. I've oh. never seen a crab. <laughs> <laughs> never. Never. I've My life is incomplete. I've ate one once and it wasn't good, so I guess I didn't really eat it. Hmm. I guess oh, it was okay. wasted. Mm. I've never eaten crab, no. I've had crab sticks. Mm. <laughs> You had crab sticks? You can buy them in a bag in England, like a giant frozen bag of them. What, what are they? Are they legs? Uh, well they, they, they like, uh, what's the fucking shape? They're a cuboid shape, so they're, uh, <laughs> they're, <laughs> they're just like, uh, they're perfectly cut, so they're not natural. Oh. The inside of the crab is perfectly cube. It's not natural. <laughs> What am I putting into my body? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I like them, they taste nice. And you can just eat them like, pretty much cold. Well, you would eat them cold, wouldn't you? They're nice though. But they, ta they taste good. You'd have to cook meat. Hmm. <laughs> Did no, you know you have to cook meat, Tom? Really? <laughs> just oh, like I potatoes. <laughs> oh, <laughs> place I've been shitting for weeks. <laughs> <laughs> for your <laughs> whole life. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, fish, I like fish, give me fish. Fish oh. is very good. Yeah, is it good for you? Probably, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Supposedly it's more healthy, but also there's probably more dirt in the ocean than we'd like to. Mm. Dirty ocean. Oh, <laughs> you're working hard on that love heart, Florian. Yes, such work. <laughs> oh, I felt love like that can draw a heart like this. <laughs> <laughs> the crab love. Yeah. What's it? What does a crab love? Do you think it, it, crab doesn't have feelings where it can just love something? Hmm, probably does. Mm. 
Maybe really? not. Hard to tell. I don't know. I don't what, what, really, what really goes on in their minds? No one can tell. Mm. Gotta crack it open to find out. Why do they walk sideways? Ooh, I don't know. Why? They just like to sidestep their problems. <laughs> well, why are they <laughs> always avoiding people? Oh yeah, they are in League of Legends too. <laughs> trained to be a psychologist and I will explore the mind of a crab. <laughs> <laughs> Next week, join me in Florida as we speak with a crab face to face. <laughs> and find out what his problem is avoiding things. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed Florian's Crabs. Oh no. <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> Subscribe, good boy. <laughs>